What is up and good morning. Um, I woke up two hours earlier today, about 10, 15. Um, I didn't get to sleep till like four last night. One, I just like, I don't think you can get your sleep schedule on track when you get to a new country, especially this far off in time zone, when you just stay in your hotel room. Like that's always been my trick when I'm traveling is like, when I get somewhere, the uh, the time change doesn't ever affect me because I get outside, I get going, like I get adjusted immediately. I get on the ground and moving. Like, um, I just feel like I'm so excited to be in a new place that it doesn't matter. I won't be sleepy. And people used to be like, oh, it's because you're young. And no, I'm 28. I'm old as now. So, um, anyways, I'm up two hours earlier. So, basically, that's two more hours I can complain on the phone. Um, that sucks for them. But obviously, breakfast is here. Not as lucky. I had to be able to go back to sleep just like so wake up till like breakfast and lunch because this is so tiny. But let's check out what it is. Um, I started watching a good show last night. Uh, it was called like Deadly something on Netflix. Like Deadly Class. Like pretty good. Pretty good. Um, ooh, breakfast. Hamburger? Like this is definitely a hamburger bun. I don't like this whole deal. Uh, of a hamburger bun. Like, or is But it is a hamburger avec eggs and hamburger toppings. So picture a hamburger with a, just with an egg in the middle and no burger. And then obviously, an egg and orange juice. This is breakfast. Like, are you kidding me? I know I'm not moving around to burn any calories, like, unless I choose to burn calories, but it's literally like starving us. This is insane. It's like saying, do not move, do not burn any extra calories in your day because you cannot afford to or you will starve. Um, granted, this is 14 days, so I can't really complain too much. I'm just trying to be funny. But at the same time, this sucks. So, see you later. Imagine the time that I have to sit there. And no, it's already day two and I already know what time they're exactly coming. Like, there's a two hour window. Or think about how long I probably sat there and waited. But it looks like a big lunch. Soy sauce. Dun, dun, dun. Are you kidding me? Basically a salad. Like this is the world's worst like forced diet. Odds are that this is tea. And it's probably garbage. Like I hate tea. Do you even poke it through? It's just a mess. This is just Was there a better way? No. Then why did it oh. That's harder. Sick. Tea. Like. I hate tea. An apple. And some broth soup. This is official. I hate my life today. What is even in this? Do I add that to this? Like. I do. I add that to that. That was so deceiving. That looked like this was going to be.
All right, so that is it. Um, got pretty difficult around the 10 to 12 minute mark. Um, I think the thing with bands is that a lot of people underestimate is that unlike dumbbells, that dumbbells, when you get up to the peak of a curl or the peak of any movement really, um, let's say you mean flies even, like once you get to here with dumbbells and doing flies, like the tension is gone. Like there's no more activation in your chest or your bicep. Like it's at a zero. It's just sitting there resting on your skeletal system. With bands, no matter if you're doing anything like flies, if you're doing cables or uh, band, uh, curls, like the further you get from the origin from where the bands are placing, the harder the weight is. So it's a completely different workout than having to use uh, dumbbells or barbells or cables, like even cables. If you're pulling 50 pounds, band, 50 pounds with cables, like the weight just stays 50 pounds throughout the whole thing, no matter where you are. Granted, you're at a weaker part where like, you know, down here in a curl versus up here, like it's gonna be a little different as far as like um, intensity goes or difficulty, say difficulty. Um, with bands, it's literally just increasing the whole time. The more you pull it, the harder it is. You're gonna have to generate even more force and that creates explosiveness. So using bands, I think is like super crucial when you're getting into wanting to train explosiveness or anything versus cables, it just doesn't really provide it. You see people at gyms like doing punches with cables, like what are you doing? There's no, there's no tension, there's no resistance. 50 pounds is 50 pounds. Like with bands, it's going to increase over that range and you have to fight against it. Like that requires so much more muscle activation as the workout goes on. But um, yeah, uh, my bands go up to 150. As you saw, so it's either I have incredibly strong biceps or the bands are not that heavy. Kind of both. Um, yeah, so around the end of it, I started kind of assisting, 10 to 12 minute mark assisting with curls, 150 cables or pounds with bands. It's pretty tough by the end of it. Um, so I'm going to get off this because I'm rambling now. Uh, next session will be in a couple minutes. I just got tattooed, so I don't want to sweat too much with it. Uh, it'll be a 15 minute block, so go by even quicker, five minutes quicker. I'm happy to be done with that. Um, if you're like me and you just can't bother to work out for the day, um, these are beautiful because 20 minutes, everybody has 20 minutes, you can just like grind it out and 15 even more so. Like, what's the excuse there? What is up? So, took about a 10 minute break right there. Um, get a breather, stop sweating a bit. I'm not gonna do dips. I will do kickbacks and close grip pushups because I don't really care for dips. And whatever way to hit triceps is way to hit triceps. Get over it. I uh, heard a knock on the door just now, and that is my dinner. So I'm gonna make this the quickest 15 minute block in the world, like I said, um, or did not say. I'm doing two today just because I feel extremely stagnant. If you wanna do one, do one. If you wanna do two, three, five, whatever. However stagnant your day is, do this to eliminate some of it and uh, keep a healthy body. Like during this time of lockdown, it's impossible to get moving sometimes if you're in the same situation I am. So pick one, get on with it. Um, yeah, let's get to it. Ow. All right. Whew. What is up? So that got a lot harder than I thought, or it just got a lot hotter in here. But um, yeah, why don't you guys follow me onto the kitchen and uh, we'll get there in a second because it's pretty far away. So I just got to walk to my giant place. Um, sick. All right, we're here. Um, a little dizzy. Uh, just the house is kind of a circle. It's like a circus style place. Whew. All right. So. Welcome to my uh, kitchen. Um, I'm gonna show you what my chef whipped up for me today, you know, uh, five star. If this is a salad, a salad, are you joking? This is it, this is my dinner. A banana. Look at the fish I got in that, and the rest is salad. Honestly, I don't mean to like complain every day, but like, come on, 
man. Help a brother out. I don't even know what this is. It's not even... Alright. 